<clears throat> Going friends, uh, today in this class of uh, methods and formulas, I want to show you how to delete those blank cells that you may have in your Excel data and uh, in between your Excel data and you want to get rid of them. Either you want to just delete those um, cells and shift the data upward or left or downward or you can fill those blank cells with something on the actually doing this uh, manually is quite a task you uh, don't want to waste uh, your time doing everything manually because uh, Excel is something very special that allows you to do things with the help of formulas and methods and believe me nobody would like to waste time if they have Excel they will always love <coughs> advantage of excel formulas to do things quite efficiently so friends i would show you how this can be done this is actually not a formula it is a kind of a method in this and you can do very easily uh, the whole process uh, is quite uh, very easy to do the method that you can delete or fill the blank cell that appear or have uh, in your Excel data. Okay, friends, I have uh, some columns with the uh, data, and uh, I need to create some blank cells in between. So I'm just removing them manually like this. I'm just removing them. Uh, if you have similar kind of data uh, and uh, you want to get, uh, okay, these are the blank cells. Uh, there's uh, data that you want to get rid of these blank cells and you want to shift your data upward or left or whatever you want uh, because it's a column data so I would like to have my data shifted upward or either downward but upward is uh, best suited for this example so I will shift the data upwards so friends uh, uh, first of all I will, I will remove the blank cells so what I will do I will select the range or the data actually selecting the data is required because if I the method selecting the range then it will apply all these the method will treat these as blank as well because we don't have to uh, do anything with these so we don't want to apply the formula in these uh, cells that are oh already blank so what I will do I will selecting the range of data that I have and it's F5 on my keyboard and it brings me go to command box as special. and here in this window you need to select blank so now what this selected all the blank cell that were in my selected range now what we have to do we have to press ctrl and minus uh, from your numeric pad of your keyboard so press ctrl and minus key it brings a delete command box here and here it asking us to how we want to treat the remaining data either we want to shift it to left right down what we want to do we want to shift the data up. so I will select this and press OK so it just fill the blank cell and fill the remaining data upward and uh, remove those blank cell you can say but what if I want to fill these blank cell with something um, something else so what I will do, I'm just going to control Z to make it to the selection of blank cell as is. And now I want to fill all these uh, selected cells that are blank with something like any not applicable. So what I will do, I will start typing without doing anything. And A. Okay. Now don't do anything. Just press control and press enter so that it will fill any in all these selected blank cells control enter 
so it automatically fill the na to all the blank which were selected so this is the easiest way of uh, removing the blank cell from your data i hope you like the video and please 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 don't forget to subscribe my video thanks sorry subscribe my channel thanks for watching